Well, it felt okay. I mean, I was uh, I was really happy with the finish. I think that uh, Eddie and I were working on trying to lengthen out and uh, keep the stroke moving forward at the end. And so I really felt good on, on the last 15 meters. That felt really good. I think that I can still work on my start a lot more. And um, yeah, I just, you know, overall, was a lot of things that I can work on and a lot of details to fix up for the next meet. So. Yeah, that was, a, that was a fun experience. I mean, it was a, kind of our first uh, real experience with other colleges. So, I mean, it was really cool to just see those guys and, uh, yeah, see some guys that I haven't seen in a while and to get up and race against them. And it was really cool and uh, I, th I really liked the, the format that we had for that meet. Um, I was able to do the 50 on one day and the 100 on another, which is really nice with no relays. So, it was a really good experience uh, and, and I really loved that meet. So, I think that I was a little bit faster in the 100 at, um, at orange and white, but other than that, I think I was, I was really happy. I think the 50 was faster, so I was, that was the best time, I think, actually, so I was really happy with that. Yeah, I mean, it was, it was kind of a, I mean, it's, it's obviously a different situation now because uh, we had the quarantine, or like the, the I guess, uh, the big break or whatever, and coming off of that, and so uh, it was kind of, it's a completely different, like, training style, I'd say, because we kind of went long course, or I went, personally went a little bit extra long course during that time, and so that was kind of a little bit different, um, yeah, and so it was just, it was a completely, it's a different style, I mean, at this point, because we're at a completely different uh, point in the season where we normally be, so it's just, it's playing something, it's playing a new hand, I guess. <laughs> I was pretty blessed, uh, my parents uh, live in Austin, so I was able to stay uh, in the Austin area during uh, March and June, which was, it was very nice, and it was, uh, I guess, uh, it was nice not to have to fly home or anything, and so it was, it was yeah, I, I pretty much uh, did a lot of dryland training, did a lot of weights, I, I improved a lot of my strength, so I was really happy with that. It's really helped me overall, I mean, uh, I remember Eddie was having me do uh, some uh, ankle stretches, and so, uh, because we were working on my flutter kick a lot, and so that I think really helped, and I think that I'm, I'm finally seeing uh, a bit of results on the flutter kick end, so yeah. I, I definitely love the out of the water time, and I think that it, hopefully it will uh, pay off at the very end, so.